Friday, y'all. Happy Friday. Hold on, I'm backing out of work. It's only 9 o'clock. So I just got to work an hour ago, but I'm taking an early lunch break <laughs> because I left this morning and forgot my water bottle. You know, my half gallon that I bought that I love so much. Uh, Clarissa, how are you liking your water bottle? She bought one too. I freaking love it. And it makes drinking a gallon of water a day, which I was, I do that or I'm very close to that anyway. I'm a, I am a water junkie. Very rarely do I drink anything else. I drink one cup of coffee in the morning. If I'm feeling like I need a, a second cup, I will, but that's rare. So I drink one cup of coffee in the morning and then water. Like my whole, that's all I ever drink. And every once in a while, I'll have a Diet Dr. Pepper or a Diet Mountain Dew. I just don't really drink anything else unless it's a, a juice or a smoothie. So anyway, I forgot my, my water bottle this morning. I had it in my hand and then I put it down to go do something before I was walking out the door and then I forgot to pick it back up. So I told Maggie, I was like, Maggie, I can't, I cannot not have my water. I, I don't, I gotta have water. So I said, I'm, let me run up to Walmart and grab another. Hopefully, this is a different water or a different Walmart from when I bought, where I bought my water bottle. So hopefully they'll have them here, but if not, I can find another one. I just need something to put water in because I cannot function without my water. It's almost like I panic if I don't have my water with me. My mother-in-law is the same way. It doesn't matter if I'm just running to the Walmart, if I'm running up to get gas, if I'm just going to be right back. I, I got to have it. It's like a person who smokes. I got to have it. <laughs> is that crazy? Anyway, so it's been an awesome week at work. It has been a great week. It's always good at work. I always love my job, but today has been really good. It's been really fun. Or this week has been really good and really fun. And uh, we always, you know, have fun on Fridays. It's a little more relaxed, you know. So, um, I don't really have anything going on this weekend except tomorrow night. Me and Shane and Maggie and her husband and maybe... And Maggie and her best friend, or I mean, Jean Tu and her best friend. So all of us girls from work and our husbands or friends or whoever, we're all going to meet up at this um, little place in Jinx called Maggie's Music Box. And we're going to eat and there's going to be live music. And it's like a bluegrass blues band called the Haymakers are going to be playing at Maggie's Music Box. So we're going to go over there and hang out tomorrow night. But other than that, you know, me and Shane are all about some live music. So other than that, we don't really have anything going on. Um, but I thought, you know what? It's been a few days. I need to vlog today. Sorry, y'all are bouncing around. Tulsa Roads. Tulsa Roads are the best. Oh, and I am going tomorrow to get the back of my hair cleaned up a little bit. I'm not getting it all cut off. Um, I'm getting, she's just going to clean up the back a little bit for me. So, anyway, I'm going to run in here to Walmart and find um, something to put water in. I wouldn't mind having another one of those half gallon jugs. That wouldn't hurt my feelings at all. They were only 10 bucks and I love it. Um, but if not, I'll find something. And then... I need to find something um, for lunch that's healthy. I don't want soup. I had soup yesterday. Last night I finished off the chili. You know those, um, I made a big pot of chili last weekend. I made the kielbasa and cabbage and I made the roast carrots and potatoes and me and Shane have been eating on it all week. And there's only a little bit of kielbasa and cabbage left, and there's only a little bit of roast left. <laughs> That's it. Ro uh, Shane went to town on that roast. I mean, he tore it up. So, 
I'm going to have to, and I really enjoyed not, although I love to cook, I love to be able to take my time, do it on the weekends, you know, not when I get home from work and I'm tired and, you know, I want to do my pole yoga and I have other things. I don't want to cook during the week, really. I do, but I like coming home and food's already ready. You know what I mean? So this weekend, I need to figure out a couple more crock pots that we can eat on. Okay, the sun's in my face. Um, I'll be back. Let's see what we can find at the Walmart. I had luck. <laughs> I had luck. First off, oh, hold on. I gotta save. I gotta save that receipt so I can fetch it. I'll put my fetch link below in case anybody wants to start the fetch app. Um, if you have any questions, let me know. I'll put my referral code and you'll get points, uh, thousands of points, and I'll get thousands of points, which you can redeem for gift cards. I like to get my, I like to get my points and use that money for Amazon. <laughs> so I get my Amazon stuff for free. Um, anyway, so the first thing I got real quick, um, I needed something for lunch. So I just got this um, veggie tray got carrots, Kobe cheese, tomatoes, snap peas, broccoli, and little turkey bites, or, yeah, turkey bites. So, I'll pick on this all day, and the girls at work can pick on it. They had one left. One. They had one left. It's a God thing. It was made for me. That's my thumbnail. Anyway, probably not the color I would have chose, but at this point, I love this bottle so much. I don't care what color it is, but this green is kind of growing on me. But I'm just like, thank you, Jesus. There was one left. This is hands down by far my favorite water bottle I've ever used or bought. And my favorite thing about it is you fill it up twice and you've gotten a gallon of water in for the day. Do you need a gallon of water a day? I don't know. That's up to you. For me, a gallon is not a problem, but it makes it less daunting um, if you do want to get a gallon of water in. Um, I love the handle. My favorite part is this mouthpiece. You don't have to tip it up. It's a straw. Freaking absolutely love it. I absolutely love it. I don't care what color it is. Love it. And then, and I'm just, thank you, Jesus, I got the last one. <laughs> and then I just, this was a impulse buy, like everything, most things when I go to Walmart. I see it, it's cute, it's affordable, I'm going to have it. Um, this is a Terra Sky, which is plus size, and I got a 1X, and it's the only one, also the only sweater they had. But I was like, I can throw that on with my cute black boots, some leggings, and it'll cover my bootay. So it's just a V-neck super duper soft long sweater and what I love about it too is the slits on the side I love that because it makes you feel less binding and it's super cute so and a v-neck is my favorite neckline and they're just it's just super cute super soft super super soft and I was like I'm gonna have that and so of course if you buy a top you gotta buy earrings and these are super simple, and they totally remind me of the uh, the 90s. And they're just a gold or a silver hoop, kind of a uh, uh, non shiny beat up silver, which I absolutely love, like a tarnished, like it's done that way on purpose. And I, you know what? I don't have any fat silver hoops. I don't have any. I haven't had any since late 80s, early 90s. So I was like, uh, this will be super cute together with my silver cross necklace. Get in my buggy. You're coming home with me. You're coming home with me. Okay, listen. I'm out of time. We gotta go to work. I'm home. Shane's over here telling me I'm needy. Where did I put my big knife? I gotta go to work. Okay, I have um, a friend mail, and I have some things I got from Amazon. My hair is like flat on this side and bubbled out on this side. I don't know. I don't know. It's fine. I got a friend mail from Aunt Debbie. Thank you, Aunt Debbie. She's just 
feels like I've never met her in person. I've never even talked to her on the phone, but I feel like she's my real Aunt Debbie in real life. That's that's how I feel. I need how do I can't even get into this. Let me see. I don't wanna I don't know where my scissors are. Hang on a second. I'm always kind of scared to cut into stuff because I'm I've cut things before. Like I bought, you know, something off Amazon and then I carelessly tore into it and tore it up. Alright. Would you send Aunt Debbie? Aunt Debbie makes everything. She hand makes her cards, her jewelry, everything. She sent a little card that she made. And she's got her little her little stamp on the back. It says music made. I hope there are days when your coffee tastes like magic, <laughs> your playlist makes you dance, strangers make you smile, and the night sky touches your soul. I hope you fall in love with being alive again. Aww. Hi, Amy. Happy Lunar New Year. We celebrate the year of the rabbit, a time of release. What hasn't worked in your life, lightening your load by decluttering. This year brings new opportunities, especially for career and creativity. Venture out, take risks. Step outside your comfort zone. This is the first of the 12-year lunar cycle, much like spring, an exciting time to start anew. Love you, Aunt Debbie. P.S. I found the Vicks shower tabs for you. They are amazing. Is that what's in this? <laughs> that is, I love that. I love that. Girl, did you pack some, let me see. Plant this heart and grow beautiful wildflowers. Are you serious? Do I just put that in water? Do I just put that in dirt? <gasps> There's seeds in there, in there. Okay, that's cool. I've never seen anything like that before. Plant this heart and grow beautiful wildflowers. Oh my God, I love that. Okay, that's going to be fun. This is all things spring, looks like. Let's see. Pretty red paper. Thank you, Aunt Debbie. <laughs> she found the big paper shower pellets for me. I couldn't find these anywhere. Thank you for sending me some. And there's three tablets. If you guys have never, um, you guys are the ones that told me about these. And if you've never tried them, I 5,000% dare you to go out and get some. They are amazing. You just throw them in your shower floor and it just, oh, it just Vicks vaporizes the whole shower. It's amazing. Clears you up. It's amazing. Thank you, Aunt Debbie. I needed those and this I'm super excited about. Okay, there's another little something in here. She's got all wrapped up. Something she made, I am sure. Oh, stop. Stop it. Stop it. How cute. Did you make these or did you order these? They got a barcode, so I bet you bought them, but either way. How freaking cute. Well, these might be music made. I bet you made them. I'm going to say you made them. Oh my God, how cute. <laughs> oh, those are going to be perfect for Valentine's. I love these. Cherie at work might try to rip these out of my ears and steal them from me. She's going to love those. How cute. So cute. Some more. Here's another pair. You spoil me. And I know you spoil Charity. And I know you spoil Madison. I know you spoil all of them. And little baby Mackenzie, too. How cute, you guys. Look at the little gnomes, little Valentine gnomes. How sweet. <laughs> I love them. I love them. I love them. And it just keeps going. Hang on, there's more. She made me a magnet. Kind people are my kind of people. Me too, sister. Me too. I absolutely love this. We're going to go stick it on the fridge right now. Oh. this. Thank you. 
All of it is precious. I love every bit of it. I cannot wait to wear my earrings and plant my flowers and jump in my shower with this. I'm going to have one of these in the morning in my shower. Thank you, Aunt Debbie. Everything is just so precious. Thank you, thank you. I love you, and I hope I get to meet you soon. I'm planning on going to see Charity, um, hopefully in the next few months. Hopefully. And then maybe we can figure something out, and we can meet then. So, thank you, Aunt Debbie, for all of that. Um, I got some stuff I ordered on Amazon, and it's here. So, let's open it up. I ordered the cutest battery operated reading lamp. So that's one of the things we're going to open. But I got other stuff too. This is what I want to show you first. I should have opened all this before I got on here with y'all, but it's okay. Are you ready? Are you ready, ready, ready? I finally broke down and got the Eau de Parfum. The body sprays smell amazing, but I wanted the perfumes. So do you guys remember when I did the body spray haul with the four little body sprays? And my favorite one was the yellow one. And then my next favorite was the purple one. And then my next favorite was the yellow one. And then my last favorite was the blue one. This blue one was my least favorite but it has become my number one favorite. It has become my number one favorite. And the pink one, that was sweet cotton candy one, that's become my number two favorite. So all my orders, as I was wearing them and smelling them and getting used to them, my two top became my two bottom and my two bottom became my two top. So now my two favorites, does that make sense? So I got, the pink one, which is a scent from above, which is, is the pink cotton candy smelling one. And then this blue one, I also got the blue, early morning breeze. Oh my God. So these are $40 a piece. And I went ahead, I went, I was just gonna get the blue one. And then I was like, Amy, just go ahead and get the other one because you'll use them. You'll use them. If I know I'm going to use something, I don't mind spending a little bit more. I don't like spending more on something I'm not sure of. Well, I can't afford that. So, open this up. Oh my God, the bottles are so pretty. These bottles. That smells good. You making the rest of that roast? He's been eating that roast all week. Look how pretty. Isn't that gorgeous? Oh, I love her. So pretty. Okay. All I can smell is roast. <laughs> Shane's got the kitchen smelling good. Oh, yeah. Okay, so it's just like the body spray, but it's stronger like a perfume would be, of course. Oh, yeah. So pretty. Love it. And then let's get into this one. Ooh, that smell good. It smells like Dolly Parton and roast up in here. It smells like we made a roast at Dolly Parton's house. That's what it smells like in here. Like we've been cooking at Dolly's house. Okay, here's the pink, and she's got a pink butterfly. So here's what they look like. You can see a clear, clear bottle, pink butterfly. And then the clear bot or clear butterfly, pink butterfly. I don't know what the hell I'm saying. You know what I'm. You see what I'm saying. You can see the difference in the butterflies. These bottles are so pretty. I need to get my sister some. She would go nuts. She's got a birthday coming up. No, she doesn't. Yes, she does. August. Okay. I'm feeling like I don't know if I like that as much as the body spray. It's not as sweet. It's more powdery. 
It's still good. But it's different. It's, this one's completely different than the body spray. The body spray is more sugary cotton candy. This is more... Older. More, um... Yeah, I'm not a huge fan of this. It, it's good, but it's not... It's a more mature scent. I'll just put it that way. Kind of powdery. So, I'm going to say, um, let's not purchase that one, unless it settles down. You know what I mean? This I love. This smells like the body spray. Yeah, yes. Yes, please. Okay, so there's those. I wonder if I could I wonder if I could send this one back because I'm not a huge fan of this one I'm gonna put it back in the package and see if they'll let me send it back yeah. let's put that back in there okay we're gonna we're gonna put this back in here because I might want to send that back I'm not a big fan of that not at all I like the blue one okay. one more box Okay, love that, love that. Okay, and then here's the other few funsies I got and then I can let y'all go. Me and Shane are gonna have date night in Johnny Lee's. Date night. Riley's not coming home this weekend, so it's like, there's no children anywhere. No, nope. I mean, no adult children. All our children are adults. Okay, so the first thing I got was dryer balls, the wool dryer balls. And this came in a pack of six. I had three that I bought from Norwex, but over time they get lost. They just do. Um, so they've got little sheep on them. These last forever. If you guys have never used wool dryer balls, I highly recommend them. And what I'll do is I've already got one wool dryer ball in there and I'll throw three more in there. And then save the other for three in case, you know, you start losing them or they get worn out. It, they last for years. But the dryer balls are awesome because um, they help your clothes dry faster. It keeps them separated while they dry, which is probably how it keeps them, how it helps them dry faster. Um, and it helps with um, static, right? And they're super cute. And when you got your dryer going, you can hear them in there. Boom, 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 boom. Like that. Uh, the next thing I got was this book because I watched um, by Dr. Edith Ever Edgar. She is the sister to Zsa Zsa Gabor, and she's got a whole YouTube video. Um, I think she's probably passed away now, but she's got a whole YouTube video of her experience um, at the concentration camps. And I watched the whole thing. It's like probably an hour long, and it is the most touching, heart-wrenching thing I've ever watched in my whole life. I'll drop the link to that video below. But when I got done watching her video, um, I had to get her book. And so I'm, I'm real excited to read that. And then this, I wasn't real sure about this. This was just a gold ring. It was a cheapie. But I was like, oh, that's online. It looks pretty. But here it looks kind of thick. It's kind of thick. And I don't know if it'll fit. So here's what, it's a, it's a hammered metal, hammered gold, and it looks really pretty. Can you see it? It looks really pretty. Here's my concern, look how thick it is. Yeah, that's okay. Take a little getting used to. It's pretty. Like on a days I didn't want to wear, if I didn't want to wear my diamond, my wedding ring, because there are days that I don't want to wear my diamond. Like if I'm exercising or it's hot outside and I know my fingers are going to swell, I'll usually wear a silicone ring. Um, but there's that. That's It looks real pretty, but we'll see. It was cheap enough, so... Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> there it goes. Okay. There's that. Okay. So put that back in there. Let me put my ring back on. What's in here? I can't remember. Oh, that's heavy. What is that? 
What is, is this part of the lamp I ordered? Because this is heavy. What in the heck? Oh, <laughs> no wonder it's heavy. I think my phone's jumping around. It is, sorry. I ordered three pound weights. That's what it is. <laughs> I have five pound and eight pound, but I needed three pounds. How funny. I was like, why is it so heavy? So I got a set of two three pound dumbbells. Okay, and then here is my rechargeable table lamp that was cute as a button on mine. I wanted a lamp to put on my end table that didn't have a cord. So I'm like, oh, well, let me just see if I can't find um, a battery operated lamp. Well, this is a battery operated lamp. It is, this is what it looks like on the box. It's rechargeable. You just charge it like you charge your phone. And then when it's charged, you can um, charge your phones in it also. I think it's got USB, I think. Hold up, let me look. Oh my God, this is adorable. Shane, this lamp is precious. Here's the charging cord, okay? Oh my gosh, this is cuter than I had hoped. <laughs> I'm sorry, what? Oh, and it's already charged. Look at this. Let's turn the light off. Oh, I'm having a total fit, look at this. Here's the button. Yes, and you can charge um, your phone on it too. I'll be dang. How cute is that? Okay. Look. Setting one, setting two. So there's two degrees of brightness. So I wanted this to set on the end table. So like when we're sitting on the couch and Shane is playing video games or he's watching a, sh a movie that I'm not into, I wanted to be able to read my books downstairs, but I never can at night because it's not bright enough. And if I want to bring a lamp over um, onto the end table, there's going to be a cord strung across the living room and I'm not doing that, which is why I wanted a, um, um, a cordless lamp. And you can move the head of it. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. This is so cute. And I don't know what the design is on there. Just little diamonds, I guess. It's very old school. It's very um, mid-mod. Mid-modern. That is precious, and I am super happy with that. Super happy with that. <laughs> and you can move it around. Okay, that's all I have. I'll get off of here. Okay, I don't like that pink dolly. I like the blue dolly. The blue dolly smells amazing. I don't like that. Don't order the pink dolly. I'm going to send that back. I don't like that one. I like the pink body spray, but I don't like the pink perfume. Okay, my puppies are hungry. I'm going to go feed them. Thanks for hanging out with me today. I love you guys. The Lord loves you more, and we will see you in the next video. I will put the links to everything in the description below. Sorry, I forgot to add that in. I'll add all the links. I'm getting better at adding links.